El Calafate, a paradisiac mountain city sitting at the lap of Andes mountain range, is often known as the gateway to the Los Glaciares National Park in Argentina. The city is located on the southern border of Lake Argentino in the southwest part of the Santa Cruz province. The name of the city is named after a little bush with yellow flowers and dark blueberries sharing the same name, Calafate. In order to reach the crown jewel Perito Moreno Glacier from the city, it takes about one and a half hours by road and the primary tour operator to facilitate such amazing experience is Yellow e Aventura. They offer very well managed tours with clearly defined itinerary you can easily understand and follow. You can check out their website from the link given in description to plan the tour that best suits you. The typical glacier tour, which they call mini trekking and mostly opted by the tourists, will cost you something around 4500 Argentine pesos or roughly 140 Canadian dollars per person as of the day of this video. The tour commences at the gate of National Park where you are offered a boat tour and transfer to the starting point of the trek. From where it's a 10 minute stroll through the woods before you can actually touch the glacier under your feet. There are certain safety procedures and quick guidelines provided by your tour guide on how to walk with a crampon under your shoes, which for the initial few minutes definitely feels quite heavy to walk with. If you were not prepared and didn't bring a good hiking shoe, do not worry. They even rent hiking shoes which helps you hold the crampon properly since those crampons means serious business on ice. Once on the ice, you are divided into two or more small groups consisting not more than 15 people each and your guide leads the way and sometimes even paves through ice to make your walk as comfortable as possible. Please don't forget to bring an empty bottle and test ice cold glacial water directly from one of the small glacial ponds. That definitely is going to be the purest water you ever test, guaranteed. At the end of this walk, there is a little bonus where you get to sip through a bag of liquor, mostly rum and whiskey, poured on ice from the glacier itself. That indeed is a fun experience which you shouldn't miss at all. After the walk, head back to the starting point and for the last leg of this journey, they will take you to the viewpoint of this amazing glacier which holds third largest freshwater source in this planet and spanning over more than 250 square kilometers and is a breathtaking view in itself. The ice walls stand tall at a height between 80 to 400 feet. The glacier is very unique in the world because of its self-healing technique due to which it remains constant in size and not receding like the other glaciers from different parts of the world.
we stayed at a lovely cozy hostel in downtown El Calafate, which is a little walk away from most of the attractions in this little city. We have provided a link of this hostel in the description below. Too tired from the glacier walk? Don't miss to take a quick walk around this city as it has many things to offer. From big souvenir stores to amazing local chocolate shops to our favorite ice bar. Yes, you heard right. There is an ice bar right at the middle of the town giving you sub-zero feel and a fancy bar experience which you will always remember. They will even click and print some instant photos from your experience which you can always bring back by spending a few extra dollars. Yeah.